All right, there. It's um, uh, I think Friday morning here. <laughs> Pretty sure it's Friday. I'm not gonna go back and check. And <laughs> Some pot. Oh, uh, one of my topics, by the way, today is impulses. Seeing impulses. <laughs> All right. Um, I have ten minutes to get this done. Hopefully, my finger doesn't hit the button again. Half the time, it seems to do that. A little overcast day. A little overcast day. It's springtime out here. Just a little scenery for you. And we're going to talk about a couple things and uh, add a new YouTube uh, buddy for this site. A little chum, I guess. And um, I like the pattern. I like the pattern. The pattern is. Uh, Someone has, you know, the drive to talk to me on the music site. Hey, you get an invite for this site because it's talk and an uh, explanation. And this one's not directed at her necessarily, but um, I'm going to address um, what I think are fans and stalkers. And uh, recently, you might be uh, familiar with Sean Johnson, U.S. gymnast. Well, the gold medal in China had a guy drive clear across the country, got stopped with the shotguns in his car, um, had a strapping tape or whatever, supposedly, and they let him go, and uh, they caught him in California, um, trying to find her on the CBS lot, I guess. And you hear about stuff like that happening. I think Madonna, Meg Ryan had stalkers or something. And uh, there's a book I was reading on the way to Venezuela, um, on the airplane down there. It's called Salcine Prophecy. Uh, not a great book as far as description. But decent as far as, uh, philosophy. You know, decent in the, you know, for a young college kid kind of thing. And it's a popular book for a while. <clears throat> and one of the ten, uh, insights that was uncovered was it in a new era... There's going to be uh, four categories of people. <clears throat> um, two which are seekers and are seeking people. And two categories that are sought. And, you know, whether you're a high level or low level on each of them, you know, it's uh, four different categories there. And that's just from my memory and, you know, paraphrasing all. In uh past 3,000 uh, views... In uh, my last uh, discussion, had to do with uh, paying for people to visit your site and all, which would seem not to be uh, ideal necessarily, but in a lot of ways, it's no different if it's done effectively than warehouse featuring your face, you know, and uh, your record company promoting your billboard on Sunset Boulevard or something like that. If it's dumb right, you would think, right? Hello, Poopy. Hello, Poopy. Here's Poopy. So we got a Poopy over here. And, uh... Alright. So, um... There's, uh... Another issue I was going to talk about. About friends. And how... How, how do we define friends? Because I think it's different... Now that we uh, have the internet and kids that grew up with friends in Russia, friends in Afghanistan, friends in South Africa, friends in Britain, you know, because of AOL. Um, obviously, America Online's uh, diminished, but um, that's how I started uh, in the late 90s was America Online. But, you know, it wasn't me that had friends necessarily out there. Um, at least not explicitly, you know what I mean? Uh, one, one, one time, uh, a long time ago during the 90s before America Online, um, I was like, you know, anyway. Well, that's, that's a tangent we're not going to go on. Um, we're, we're talking about, uh, pen pals and uh, the recycler and all that. And curiosity of, uh, running the people overseas. But, uh, basically today's kids grew up a little different. Um, 
The word's relegated. In my generation, we're a little more relegated to uh, geographical friends. Um, you know, geography meaning, hey, see this street right here? All right, and you look down that street, and, and, and you go a mile around, let's say a mile, mile and a half around around here. And uh, as far as the peers, I have a selection of a handful of people. A handful of people. I mention, not by name, but my JEO. Um, if you make a right on this street over here, uh, my JEO lived uh, down the street over there and we went to uh, elementary for a while it's now a middle school that's between us now, there's a guy I used to skateboard with that's uh, down the street to the left and there's a handful of people out here it's a you know rural section of the town uh, a little more rural than other places and it's called, you know, being relegated to your geography. But internet's open that up. And if it's done effectively, then there's no reason to be as afraid, you would think, as a scare stories that you once had on Montel Williams <coughs> when, when, when that was out. Now, uh, we have the issue of uh, the cyber stalking as opposed to just being a fan, you know? And uh, some people have, I mentioned Britney Spears before, the money for the PR firms and for the agents and for the security and the, the multi-layers of an effective unit where you don't have to worry so much about it. <clears throat> and some people, you know, are doing it on the fly. Hey man, I play guitar and hey, I'm chancing it with the public, right? And uh, more power to you and all. And uh, you like to believe in a world where you don't get a load of, uh, where, where that's the exception to the rule. Let's say the, the, the Sean Johnson with a guy coming at you with uh, shotguns and God knows the, the intent and what the outcome might have been. But, uh, yeah, the, 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 those are issues. And let's say that the Facebook thing, where um, I, I'm inclined to keep that quaint myself. I've seen some people that have a few hundred friends, and uh, I try to keep mine classroom size. Be, be because of uh, uh, the words called extrapolation in chemistry, where uh, you could project certain behaviors of certain people uh, and um, maybe, maybe that's for a discussion uh, later on uh, the, the, the idea of extrapolation and saying okay man th this is what a uh, uh, certain individual's done so far you know this, this guy that I, I don't even know has asked for friendships of 7 of 10 people that I just added who the hell is that guy you know you ever get that and I don't know. I really don't know, man. But um, I try to have fun with it. So uh, we got some birds uh, chirping up here. Got some birds chirping up there. And we have about a minute left. Um, but yeah, I just want to uh, wake up and talk about uh, that issue here. Um, uh, one of the other things, too is uh i'm about to add a, a song i just added an elvis presley song and i try to keep it mixed up at the youtube.com homer cocktail about to add a song by rockwell right now um i i i'm a mild believer in strength and diversity as far as uh you know hey man fucking got some elvis here got some rockwells i got 60s 70s 80s and that's just me i wasn't so much that way when i was younger but that's me now. So uh, if you ever get a curveball on that site, I hope you enjoy it, man. But that's all for now.